Hi everyone, about a minute on the staggering growth that is happening in China's electricity sector. Uh, in fact, it's growing by about one Germany per year, which is just at a staggering rate of growth. Uh, before I get that, if you don't know me, my name is Robert Bryce, I'm a reporter. I've been writing about, uh, speaking about energy and power for more than 30 years, I've written six books, co-produced two documentaries. I give you the numbers and the facts, not the spin about energy and power. Okay, so back to China. Uh, I published a piece on Substack this morning, and I used IEA data and some EIA data, but looked at what's happening in the global electricity market, and a global electricity demand is soaring. In fact, it's going to grow by about 4% this year and another 4% next year. This is the fastest growth uh, since 2007. But the report pays particular attention to the growth in India and China. So I'll just talk about China here because uh, India is a whole nother story. But China, of course, is the world's biggest coal consumer. It consumes about 58% of the world's coal. And the vast majority of the coal that China consumes is, of course, used to make electric power. Um, but here was the part of the IEA report that caught my eye, which uh, they said that China's power sector now is adding about one new Germany's worth of electricity per year. And I looked it up and sure enough, it's exactly right. Last year, China's electricity generation grew by, what was it, 608 terawatt hours. Germany's total generation last year was uh, 518 terawatt hours. And further, uh, the IEA says that China's uh, growth of adding one new Germany per year is going to continue for the next year or two. So this is just a staggering amount of electricity demand that China is adding every year and what are they using it for? Well, of course, they're using it to, you know, there are 1.4 billion people in China. They're using it for their homes. But, of course, it's also being used by industry to produce consumer goods, industrial goods that China then ships to the rest of the world. Um, so China, you know, these numbers, are, I mean, they just are jaw dropping. And China is going to continue to do what China does. And, and that is to look after China's interests. Uh, one other quick point. Yes, China is building more new nuclear power plants than any other country in the world. Uh, but as I also point out in my piece on Substack, it's building about six times more new coal-fired capacity as it is building new nuclear capacity. Those are just the facts, not the spin. And yet we're just inundated with these claims. Oh, the U.S., we're going to lead the world and, and decarbonize. Well, the reality is that it's, it's a Western conceit that what we're doing is going to change the trajectory of global emissions and therefore uh, global temperatures. But I write about this, of course, on my Substack, uh, the piece I published this morning on global electricity demand. You know where to find me, robertbryce.substack.com. Thanks a lot. See ya.